Hey up, so I'm back, as you can see. Back with Amy, you'll be pleased to see. Uh, and my predictions didn't go very well, did they? I'm embarrassed for you. Yeah, I got everyone wrong, basically. Mystic Mick. Mystic Mick. Would have yeah. been better off getting Paul the Octopus. Correct, probably, yes, definitely. That's the World Cup, is that the World Cup thing? Yeah. Yeah. Do you think you had sunstroke or something? Probably was, because they've been like summing it up on the Costa. Do you want me to do these ones? Uh, I mean, you can't do any worse than I did. No. No. Definitely not. Um, so, yeah, I think that went... But to be fair, we've just seen Stuart win, and I, I couldn't be more delighted for him, to be honest. So, although he wasn't my prediction, uh, I'm genuinely, you know, buzzing that he won. Winner, winner, chicken dinner. Correct. Correct. Uh, so, I mean, I've got to keep predicting now. I mean... I can't get any worse, can no. I? No. So... I've had a few thoughts of my own. There we go. I don't think I'm made for this celebrity lifestyle, Michael. Why not? What do you mean? You're not retiring. I might retire. Really? It's life in the spotlight. Really? Has it yeah. been too, just been too much? Brian doesn't like my uh, videos. Does he not? No. And I'm thinking, has it not occurred to him that he could just not watch if he doesn't like me? <laughs> he could not watch, Vote yeah. with your but feet, he... Brian. Yeah, I mean, I, I, I think the over... It's been, the, the, the feedback's been pretty positive, generally. Also, didn't realise we were inviting ourselves to feedback on our kitchen. And uh, no. our selection of knobs. Have we had uh, slagged the knobs off? Well, no, someone was a bit put out. I think on the screen you can't see that some of them are pulley and not. Right, okay. But anyway, apart from that... Yeah, it's been overwhelmingly good. Well, apart from your predictions, which have been overwhelmingly bad, but we... Correct. <laughs> um, anyway, you're going to go for it again? That's... Every credit to you for having another crack. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> <coughs> Ooh, I've been ill, that's has Tenacious. Bit, yeah, a bit run down. Um, well, obviously, the first semi-final is, um, I don't know what order they play. Kyron Wilson and Dave Gilbert. Yep. Um, I really thought John would win that, but I've said, did say, that Kyron's a bit of a dark horse. He's slipping through the draw quite unnoticed. Yeah. I didn't hear that because you were just gushing about John so much. Yeah. I mean, to be fair, he's, he's John again, isn't it? But um, anyway, but um, he's gone now. Um, I, d I really don't know how to call that. No. Because I've... Yeah, I really don't know. And the fact that you're still thinking about it is laughable. Just, I know, but it's a tough one, that is. You've got a 50-50 chance of getting it right. I know. Like in all the matches. Yeah. Yeah. Um, I'm going to go... I really don't know. No. I'm going to go with... Dave. Oh. Yeah, I, I, and I just can't pick one. I, I genuinely, I mean, 17, 15. I, I don't know. I don't know. I mean, listen, I like, I've practiced with Dave a lot and I know how brilliant he is. Um, uh, he was, uh, he's, you know, he's been a fantastic player for years and obviously so is Kyron, but I've got to pick one. Yeah. And I feel like I'm going to pick Dave, but uh, again, that is just, I mean, it's just impossible to call. Why don't the you try and be concise right, well, the more I think about it, The more I think about that game, it just changes. So yeah. if you ask me in 10 minutes, I'll probably say Karen. Yeah. So just to hedge your bets. Just to hedge your bets, yeah. <laughs> Karen so, was the only player that was in the top 16 before this tournament. Did you know that? Yes. Uh, well, well, now that's in the... What do you mean? Well, that's my research. Oh, that's in the semi-finals. Yes, yes, that's um, fascinating. Yes, yeah, well, I think it's got. It's an Can we crack on? Because I want to go just to say, bed. It's just an example of how strong the game is at the minute. You know, there's more than 16 players good enough to be in the top 16. Yeah. Yeah. So. Jack Jones and Stuart Bingham. Well, I've I've backed against Jack every match. To be honest, you're going to so do it again. I feel like. Um, we aren't we thinking Stuart to win the whole goddamn thing? That would be that. That would be fantastic, and I'd be really, really chuffed for him. Um, I think I've got to go with Stuart, but like you know, Jack keeps and he's not personal. It really isn't. 
Jack, if you if you I'm sure you're watching this, um, not that you've got much. It's probably to... going straight down to the bookies. Yeah, no, he wouldn't do that because so, not allowed no. to bet. No, no but no. were he allowed to bet? Because your probably, advice is, is yeah. Yeah, um, so I've got to go with Stuart. Experience, you know, his experience of what he won it. One those one the table set up. Score. <sighs> Seventeen. Twelve. All right. Well, 17-13. And that's my prediction. But um, the first one, I've changed my mind again, <laughs> to be honest. But oh I, I, I've got to pick one. And I'm going for Dave. I just think. I, 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 I don't know. But I've go, got to pick one and go for Dave. Yeah. So that's right, that, then. basically. All right. Have uh, a nice evening, Brian. Yeah. You've obviously hurt a little bit. You broke her heart a little bit. It's not really No, nice. it's fine. Is this why you're retiring? Because you can't stand it? Yeah, that. Yeah. I think you should keep carrying on, darling. You're doing really well. All right. All right, thank you. I know. So we'll you have a nice bank holiday weekend, Brian. Whatever you're doing with your family and loved ones. It's taking it very well. <laughs> uh, yeah, well, we'll see how we go and I'll speak to you for the final. Bye. Bye.